and welcome to another Wix tutorial by Profile Tree. Today what we're going to talk about is creating an email campaign using Wix. To begin creating an email campaign, go to your site's dashboard. So I'm just going to log in here first and then we'll get to the dashboard. So to get to your site's dashboard, select which site you're going to be using which one you're going to create the email campaign for and click select and edit site. And then you're just going to click on marketing tools. <coughs> Excuse me. And then click email marketing. Okay, so please note that when you make your first email campaign you're taken directly to the email campaign editor, which you're going to see here. Okay, so this, this is the editor. You can only access the email marketing dashboard after you've created your first email campaign. So, this is the campaign here. So we're going to write a catchy header for our Jack's Jersey's website. So we'll pretend that the World Cup's on this, this summer. And we're just going to say get your World Cup jerseys now. Something catchy, something that will stand out. And then every email has a main message. Tell your audience what you want them to know, how you take action and where to reach you. So this is to grab the attention of your target audience. And this is where if you still have their attention, which you should if you're headline is good enough, this is where you want to tell them the information. So things like what sort of sales you've got on this summer, what, what you're going to do. So for example, And maybe put a link. To your website. And then this is pretty much just like the, the website itself. You can remove and add your own photos. And play about with the formatting. And then once you're happy with how it looks, for the sake of it, we'll add a photo to the campaign, just for an example. So go to upload media, upload from computer. And <coughs> excuse me. page and then just play about with the formatting try and keep it the same as your website so if you remember if you watched my last video the, the font that we used was Chelsea market so if we find it it's not actually here just try and find a similar font then to the one you use on your website and format it all same have links to your social media your website and then put your details in and then once you're ready you can preview and test so this is what your end user is going to receive and if you're happy with that go back to editing and click next and then this is where you should have built up a mailing list using your website where you had the quiz the quiz on the website which was made in order to get customer information and then from that you create a mailing list and from that you can import contacts onto this and then that's who gets that's who receives your email campaign 
Once you've done that, if you click publish, and that's your campaign live. So to summarize, just try and format the campaign in a way that links in with your brand by using the same colors that are seen on your website and social media. And also remember to include your company logo. You may need to upgrade uh, to Wix Premium to remove the Wix advertisements from your email campaign, which is recommended if the campaign is for commercial use and is to be taken seriously. The best and most successful campaigns that you'll see are those that are informative, visually superior and have a personal element. For example, using the person's name is not enough. You need to retrieve some kind of meaningful, relevant personal information from your recipient via your website. The best way to gain this is through having a form and asking detailed questions on this form. The best way to get people to actually use your form is to create a competition. For example, win tickets to a popular music concert. People will enter their information for a chance to win and then you use this information to add them to your mailing list for your email campaign. Each month with the free plan, you can send a total of 5,000 emails over the course of three campaigns or mailings. The monthly quota resets on the first of every month, regardless of which day of the month your campaign was first set up. So that's a little bit of information about email campaigns on Wix. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to get in contact. You can email us at hello at profiletree.com or visit our website at www.wix.com profiletree.com. Thanks, goodbye.